alligator safety. We're in South Carolina. I'm about tired of these gators. Gotta go north. <laughs> All right, guys. So when we are not on cruise boats or toward Airbnbs, we are generally out here in the woods. So today we're going to show you some of the free campsites that we found along our route. Look at that big opening over here. Let's see. Oh, that's wild back in there. Yeah, they have a lot of just primitive hike and camping areas. Well, the hikers we seen coming in from the parking area was, um, they had a wagon to bring all their stuff back. Oh, yeah. Now this water is dark. That water is darker than my coffee. Ooh. Oh my. Yeah, you can't, the re reflection, you can't see just how black this water is, but oh my goodness, that is, that is something. That there's some creepy crawlies in there. When we're out hiking like this, we try to go on two or three daily walks, or when we're out camping rather, and see what we can explore. And we have been lucky this time, there's nice laid out paths and roads for us to stay on, so we've done really well this time. <laughs> Yes, every time. There's actually signs that we can read. <laughs> no maps, just signs. Go this way. Kind of like, where was that? Um, the observation tower in Tampa. The manatee stop. Manatee stop. Um, and the map was like, up, down, left, right. That I can do. This is where you go. And this is Ashley Campground. Nice little day use shelter here the huge grill and the restrooms we have found a path so let's go check it out as you can see the trail just kind of keeps going we'll see what's our longest bend down here it's no shade no shade back here so what we're seeing is the trail is more and more of the same, which is great for horses, but we have determined it is way too hot with no shade out here. So we're gonna head back into camp and have some lunch. All right, so Goose Creek Pasture is far more for um, snowbirds with their campers. There's a few tent campers. There are some hammock campers, lots of kayakers and fishers. So fishers, fishermen. Lots of fishermen. <laughs> so we're going to go check it out. We've had a lot of rain since we've been here, though. So very, very mushy. Yeah. Yes. Here. Now, this is another free site here in Florida. You, When you get here, you fill out a self-assigned permit for up to 10 days. It has our own little setups here. It's kind of cool. That's when you get your tents, your little campers, your big RVs. Everyone just hanging out. Little canals here. Look. I like this place. It's just, there's some sinkholes where the river disappears into and comes back up. Back to, to the hike up to the... If the roadways clear out enough, it's been kind of wet, so if they clear out enough, we'll try to get there. If not, we will enjoy this view. Yesterday, there was, what, probably about 20 kayakers coming down at one time? Twenty or more, yeah. And today, we got some, but they haven't made it back this way yet. <laughs> yeah, well, we're watching. That reflection's really pretty. Oh, there's Spanish moss. So, fireplaces, they're out like this. Lots of picnic tables. Peninsula over here. There's some gentlemen hanging hammocks over in there last night. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's very peaceful out here. Yeah, it says uh, Five Rivers Adventures. I got an airboat. Probably bring it back here see if anybody wants to work. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's really busy out here. I definitely say there's more campers and tents set up than what would be considered spots. It's a first come, first serve. You don't have to go on and reserve this one like a lot of the other ones in Florida. So pretty. Back here, though. No cover overs. There's little covers back here. And this one is just south of Charleston. It's Elmwood Recreation Center. It's a hunt camp back here. Here's a little sign. Which is full of spiders and such. And it's Francis Marion National Forest. Uh-huh. Alligator safety. We're in South Carolina. About tired of these gators. Gotta go north. <laughs> Alright, so I hope that gives you all some ideas about some places to stay so far in South Carolina and Florida. We will definitely be touring a few others along the route and let you know all about them. If you guys like this content, please make sure and like, share, and subscribe. Thanks, guys.